welcome to Sexy City YouTube channel. I just went around in nature and I picked some things up. I don't know about you, but I love stones and just looking at things in nature and getting inspired. So here are some ideas that you could create a motif from. I kind of recommend just finding things instead of picking things. I did pick this, but it's best basically just to find something. So if you have a little seashell, you can create a motif from that. Um, some stones, a leaf, an acorn. I thought this was kind of cool with how it's all wrinkly. Even this looks like an interesting pattern or a design. You'd be surprised how much from nature we get our designs and patterns. Great. For my motif, I chose this. What I liked about it was I have a big shape and a small shape and I can make a pattern out of it. So I see a circle for the big shape and a small circle here. I also see that this rounds off and becomes a little bit bigger. And I like how they connect. And you wanna keep this simple. You do not want it to get too complicated because <laughs> a design is simple. Just think of a logo. If you've ever seen anybody have a logo, they keep it really, really, really simple. And if you see patterns in fabric and you see patterns on wallpaper or patterns on um, tiles, that is a design, if not a motif. All right, I'm pretty happy with my motif. I'm gonna stick. Okay, when you have your motif, I recommend taking a Sharpie, a thick one or a thin one, or any type of pen, and outline it, simplify it a little bit more. Great, thanks for tuning in, liking, and subscribing to my YouTube channel.